Have you ever had moments where it feels like nothing is going your way? Like the whole world is against you or your prayers are left unanswered? In such times, it's easy to feel lost or even abandoned. But what if I told you that Allah might be working behind the scenes, guiding things in ways you can't see yet? The truth is, Allah's assistance often comes in subtle, almost invisible ways. These are easy to miss, but incredibly powerful once you become aware of them. In Islam, we are taught that Allah is closer to us than our own jugular vein, fully aware of our challenges, dreams and worries. The Quran reminds us, and whoever fears Allah, he will make for him a way out. This verse is a profound reminder that even when the way forward seems unclear, Allah is quietly working in the background, helping us navigate through difficulties. In this video, we're going to dive into seven signs that show Allah is silently helping you, even when you feel isolated. These aren't just random events, they are divine interventions, showing how deeply Allah cares for you and how actively He is involved in your life. So, Stick with us as we reveal these subtle yet powerful signs of Allah's quiet assistance in your life. Sign number one, doors keep closing. Ever been in a situation where every opportunity seems to just slip away? Maybe a job you really wanted didn't come through or a relationship ended suddenly. It's natural to feel disappointed when doors close, but in Islam, we learn that closed doors are often signs of Allah's protection and guidance. The Quran reminds us, but perhaps you hate a thing and it is good for you, and perhaps you love a thing and it is bad for you, and Allah knows while you know not. This verse is a reminder that what seems like a setback might actually be divine protection. When a door closes, it could be Allah's way of steering you away from something harmful or guiding you towards something better. It's a sign that Allah is working on your behalf, even if it's not obvious right away. Instead of feeling defeated, reflect on how these closed doors could be blessings in disguise, pushing you toward the path that is truly right for you. Sign number two, feeling unexplained calm during chaos. One of the clearest signs that Allah is silently helping you is when you feel a strange sense of peace, even in difficult situations. You might be going through something tough, yet you find yourself at ease, like something is protecting you from the full weight of the hardship. The Quran says, And we made their hearts firm and strong with the light of faith when they stood up and said, Our Lord is the Lord of the heavens and the earth. This verse speaks to the power of Allah to give inner peace and resolve to believers in times of trial. This calm is a sign that Allah is with you, guiding you through the storm. It's a quiet reminder that no matter how difficult things get, you are never truly alone. This peace is a gift from Allah, allowing you to handle challenges with patience and strength, even when everything around you feels chaotic. Sign number three, guidance through subtle signs. Sometimes, Allah speaks to us in ways that aren't immediately clear. Have you ever been stuck with a problem and then out of nowhere, a solution comes through an unexpected source? Maybe it's a verse from the Quran, a hadith that resonates with you, or advice from someone that fits perfectly with what you're going through. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, I have left you with two things. You will never go astray as long as you hold on to them, the Book of Allah and my Sana. This hadith reminds us that guidance is always there for us through the Quran and Sana. These small signs are Allah's way of guiding you toward the right decisions. Stay alert and open to these signs because they are clear indications that Allah is working in your favor even in the most confusing situations. Sign number four, delays and the need for patience. In today's world, we expect everything to happen instantly, but Allah's timing is always perfect, 
even when it doesn't match what we hope for? Have you ever prayed for something and felt let down when it didn't happen right away? That delay could be Allah's way of preparing something far better for you. The Quran teaches us, and be patient, for indeed, Allah does not allow the reward of those who do good to be lost. This verse reassures us that patience is rewarded and that delays often serve a greater purpose. When things don't happen according to your timeline, it's easy to feel frustrated. But these delays might be Allah's way of ensuring you receive something much greater than what you initially asked for. Patience in these moments shows trust in Allah's plan, and this trust often leads to blessings far beyond what you imagined. Sign number five, being protected from harm. There are moments when you narrowly escape danger or avoid something harmful, and it feels like pure luck. But in truth, these are signs of Allah's protection. The Quran says, and whoever relies upon Allah, then he is sufficient for him. Indeed, Allah will accomplish his purpose. This protection can come in many forms. Maybe you avoided an accident, missed a flight that later had issues, or decided not to go to a place where something bad happened. These are reminders that Allah is always looking out for you, protecting you from harm in ways you might not even realize. Think back on moments where things could have gone wrong but didn't. These aren't coincidences. They are signs of Allah's silent help, shielding you from dangers you may never fully understand. Sign number six, receiving unexpected help. Have you ever received help out of the blue when you least expected it? Whether it's a friend offering assistance, a stranger lending a hand, or stumbling across the exact resource you needed, these aren't just random acts of kindness. They are signs that Allah is orchestrating events to support you. The Quran tells us, and he will provide him from sources he never could imagine. This verse is a reminder that Allah's support often comes in ways we can't predict. When you experience unexpected help, take it as a sign that Allah is always aware of your needs and is working behind the scenes to make sure you are taken care of. These moments of support show that you are never truly alone in your struggles. Sign number seven growth through hardships. Sometimes, the very struggles that seem overwhelming are the ones that help you grow the most. Allah often uses difficulties to strengthen your faith, patience, and character. The Quran states, indeed, with hardship will be ease. This verse reassures us that every challenge we face has a purpose and leads to growth. When you reflect on your life, you might realize that the toughest times were also the ones that led to the most personal and spiritual development. These aren't just tests, they are opportunities to develop qualities that draw you closer to Allah. Rather than seeing hardships as setbacks, recognize them as signs that Allah is refining you, making you stronger and more resilient. It's through these challenges that you often find your true strength and faith. Conclusion. By recognizing these signs in your life, you'll start to see that Allah is always working on your behalf, even when it feels like nothing is happening. These subtle, silent interventions are reminders of His constant presence and care. When you stay mindful of these signs and keep your faith strong, you'll find peace in knowing that Allah is guiding, protecting, and leading you towards something better. Remember, Allah's help doesn't always come in obvious ways, but it's always there. Trust in His plan, be patient, and remain open to the signs of His silent assistance. Even in the toughest times, you are never truly alone.